Yeah. All right, Shalom, Shalom. All right, I'm going to start saying all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakar Kadash. Uh, double honors to our apostle, Ezra, Great Millstone, peace and mercy be unto the Lord. Like out there, <laughs> it's teaching the word and truth and sincerity and making it by his little sacrifice for our Lord, Savior, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai. I'm the brother Omar from the branch of GMS Cleveland. Come back at you another video. And, um, you know, real quick, man, I um, just want to get a few uh, few scriptures, man, uh, concerning, um, you know, trusting in the Lord, man. And, um, you know, the times we're approaching, man, and uh, how, like, our, our faith is totally geared towards trusting in Yahweh by Shemel Shah because, you know, um, while the world is preparing carnally, you know what I'm saying, uh, you know, stacking up, uh, you know, uh, canned goods and, you know, Investing in the silver and cryptocurrency and all these other things, which there's nothing wrong with those things, but your trust as a man of the Lord, as a believer, if you're a woman, you know what I'm saying? Um, well, first, first, first and foremost, if you're a man or if you're a woman, you know what I mean? Or if you're just a believer in general, you can be a child. Um, your, your, our trust is in uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah because we understand that those carnal things are, are exactly what they are. They're just carnal. They're not going to save you. You know, so without further ado, let me get into it, man. It's uh, uh, second temp, second Samuel chapter twenty three, verse um, uh, verse thirty one. It says, uh, "As for Yahweh, His way, it says His way is perfect. It says, um, the word of the Lord is tried. He is a buckler to all them that trust in Him, man. And when you look at that word buckler." It's, just, it's a basically is a very small shield, you know, that uh, men used to use for combat back in, uh, you know, the ancient world. And I'm pretty sure they still do it um, in certain places, you know, to this day, you know, whether you're, you know, you're handling a sword or, you know, practicing or whatever. But a buckler is something that protects you, man, shields you, you know, from attacks. So our Heavenly Father, you know what I'm saying, and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shemashah, uh, they they are going to be our protection, Lord willing. You know what I'm saying? In that day, when all hell is breaking loose, man. Hell, they've been our protection all the way up until this time. You know, so how the hell do you think you know we're still living and breathing and walking around? You know, it, it's not. You know, every every day you wake up, that's all according to Yahweh Bashim Shah. That's all Him uh, protecting you from. You know, things that you see and things you don't see, man. You know what I mean? Uh, spirits. You know what I'm saying? And uh, certain um, spiritual things in high places, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, certain energy, certain vibrations. You know what I'm saying? All, all type of things, man. So, you know, we have to thank y'all by Shim Yaw Shah on a daily basis, man. You know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, me personally, I'm trying to make that, uh, you know, uh, trying to perform those, you know, those actions even more, man. You know what I'm saying? Waking up, praying. You know what I'm saying? Going to sleep, praying. So forth and so on, man. Just, uh, you know, offering up those righteous sacrifices, man. But, um... It says, uh, for who is Yahweh, save the Lord, and who is a rock, save our power. It says, Yahweh is my strength and power, and he maketh uh, my way perfect, man. So it's, the, it's Yahweh by Shemuel Shah that's, um, that's going to protect us in that day. Because people ask us, well, I'm pretty sure brothers have got asked, um, you know, when we're speaking about these things, whether it be on the highways and byways or in, per you know, or in person, if you're having a conversation with somebody in person, or on the, uh, you know, on the common board, you know what I'm saying, or over the phone. We speak about the death that's coming. People, you know, they tend to ask, well, what, what are you going to do in that day? You know what I'm saying? Well, what we're going to do, we're going to trust in Yahweh Hashem Yahshah. Like we, like we have been doing, man. That's, that's, it's called faith, man. You know? You, you, it says without faith, it's, an, it's impossible to please him, man. You have to have faith, man. You know? Uh, without that, like I said, it's impossible to please him, man. It's, he that cometh to Yahweh Hashem Yahshah must believe that he is, man. And like I said, without that, you know, you're, 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 you're gone. You're through. You know, uh, let me see, uh, this is, uh, Proverbs 29 and 25. The fear of man bringeth a snare, but whoso put up his trust in the Lord shall be safe, man. Yeah, so, uh, people fear, uh, man, you know what I'm saying, right now, the man that, that wields all the power is Esau, Edom, and there's any other smaller nations, man, you know, that's, that's, that, that's in cahoots with the beast, uh, and the whore that rides upon it. You know what I'm saying? They they fear man and they fear what men can do. You know what I'm saying? Like Esau, Edom, he you know he takes away certain government uh government to, uh pro government programs from you, whether that be uh food stamps, uh, you know uh current, you know a uh, money uh money uh 
you know, uh, substances and stuff like that that's, that's help support and paying your bills or whatever. So they fear man what he can do and what he can take away. But ultimately, it's up to you how about Shemiel Shah, man. It says, but whoso put of his trust in the Lord shall be safe, man. Yeah, so like I said, man, you're not going to beat a dead horse. Like I said, I said it time in, time out. We trust in the Lord, man. So we, we trust in the Lord so far over all the way up to this time. No matter how long you've been in the truth, whether it's two years, three years, four years, 10 years, 15, 20 years. That, that whole time you've been putting your, your trust in the Lord. So why well, quit now? We're going to keep going, Lord willing. We're going to keep going strong with it. It says, many seek the ruler's favor, but every man's judgment coming from the Lord, man. Yeah, so everybody is seeking the favor of these men. That, uh, you know, it's carnal men on earth that has to have the power. But like I said, man, we're going to trust in the Lord no matter what happened. Lord willing. You know what I mean? Y'all by Shemel Shaki, the spirit upon us. And, uh, you know, we keep doing what we've been doing. Keep putting up these videos. You know what I'm saying? Keep teaching. Keep edifying. And it's, uh, keep uplifting the names of Yah Bashim Al Shah. Uh, last scripture. This is uh, Proverbs chapter. Uh, it's like a Psalm chapter forty verse three. It says, he, "And he had put a new song in my mouth." It says, "Even praise unto our God. Many shall see it and fear and shall trust in the Lord." Man. Yeah. So, hey. With that, I pray this. I pray this edifying. I'm giving all praise and glory to Yahweh Bashim Al Shah Bashim Al Krakadash. Uh, double on the store, possibly as a millstone, peace and mercy, being told us elect. Hey, shalom, and the Bible ball.